Hi everyone, this is Jay Purcell, your golf pro here at Friendly Hills Country Club. Uh, definitely wish you and your family health and safety during these difficult times we're having. As you know, we still have play out here on the golf course though. We're very fortunate. Uh, we have been noticing a couple things and I want to go over them with you. One is uh, preserving our golf course and keeping it beautiful. Uh, Neffy and his crew and Russ of course has been doing just a, a marvelous job this place looks beautiful and we want to keep it that way so first I'm gonna go over ball marks on the green it's something that we we've noticed and make it our rounds out there there's been way too many ball marks and I'd like to go over it with you so Taylor if you come in here we'll zoom in a little bit closer I'd like to make a ball mark on the green and show you how to fix it so it recovers well so Taylor zoomed in here and what we see is a ball mark that I made with my golf ball and I want to show you the proper way to fix it. What we want to do is we want to go around the mark itself, around the diameter of the mark and we want to pull it in. Pull it in. See how I'm going around it and pulling it in? Pull it in. There we go. Looks good. Right there you can see it's just like new. And then we're gonna tap it down. And you can you can tell that, uh, well, you can't tell that it was ever there. So that's the proper way to fix a ball mark. And we wanna see you all do it because, you know, we have beautiful greens out here. We're very fortunate and we wanna keep them that way. So you gotta help me out. So the next thing I wanna to talk to you about is bunkers. As you all know, since the coronavirus, we can't put rakes around the bunker, so this is what I want you to do. So hopefully when you're in the bunker, you're doing this, you're playing lift clean in place, because you might be in a footprint since we don't have any rakes. So what I would do with my ball here is I would lift clean and I could place it right there on a better spot, right? Hopefully you're all doing that. And then I'd go and proceed to hit my shot out of there. pretty good for not playing for a while but now you can see I have all these footprints right here and what I want to do is I want to rake it with my foot I could kick it just so it looks good it's not going to be perfect I could also do it with my club and again we always want to enter the bunker as you know should know from the the shortest path to the ball so we don't have to make a lot of footprints and that's it that's how we want you to do it okay now let's talk about uh, a very important topic that we've been a little bit lax on for the last uh, you know six weeks it's dress code okay we have to start getting firm with our dress code again of course we want the guys to have their shirts tucked in collars wearing slacks or shorts and of course for the gals, it doesn't have to be a collared shirt, but it has to be golf and uh, no sweats or athletic clothing out here. So keeping that, uh, keeping that point, dress code is very, very important and crucial to the club. And please observe the dress code when you're out here. Okay, and lastly, what we wanna talk about is golf etiquette out at Friendly Hills Country Club. You know, pace of play, Issues are very important for the survival of the club. They really are. So we don't want to take more than four hours and 15 minutes. Doesn't matter if we're walking or not. I know we're all walking right now. Four hours and 15 minutes has got to be the max. The other thing is practice on the, the golf course. And this goes out to my juniors too. I know we don't have a uh, practice range right now, but it's very important that you don't, you know, drop in one ball or a second ball is okay but when you're dropping a whole bunch of balls and practicing on the golf course and making those ball marks like we talked about earlier that's not good so that's golf etiquette so to my juniors out there mainly because I see that happen out there and all all of our members no practicing out on the golf course now with all that being said we can keep this place as beautiful as it should be Again, wish your family the best. Stay healthy. See you next time.